So here we are, we're in the Ford uh, dealership, my car's behind me, and we're going to have a little walk over and uh, see if we can spot this new RS, or not as the case may be. And there's my first sight of the new one. It's elemental, awe-inspiring. Ford Focus RS sets the benchmark for driver exhilaration. A specially engineered 2.3 litre engine and innovative all-wheel drive system deliver more responsive power with superior traction and agility. Designed to maximise your experience of road and track, Ford Focus RS delivers the greatest satisfaction to drivers serious about performance. That's what it says in the brochure. Three hundred and fifty millimeter ventilated front disc brakes with lightweight Brembo four piston monoblock calipers, painted blue. Someone's taken the steering wheel, shoved it on the wrong side. This car's in nitrous blue with forged gloss black alloys. That very good too. Coming in better. Let's hope the Ford Sync 2 navigation system with 10 premium Sony speakers, including the subwoofer and rear camera, works. Okay. Here's a happy already purchaser. Six weeks I'm waiting. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> okay, one sentence. Why? Why did you buy the Mark III RS? Five doors, performance, love RSs. The high performing character of RS is reflected throughout the car. A new flat bottomed leather trim steering wheel enhances the performance driving experience. It's a true five seat. Pop the bonnet. How to lift the bonnet. This is the first intelligence test that's Failing. been mentioned by Ford. <laughs> failing, failing miserably. <laughs> Caught on camera. Yeah, oh, there we go. Hooray! Okay. Well, it's not like BMW, it doesn't stay up on its own. That's the new 2.3 litre Ford EcoBoost engine. So we've just had a look at the um, at the Mark III RS, and uh, it looks great in the the blue. The nitrous blue is uh, a really nice colour. The wheels look great. They, um, I think, they those black Ford wheels look really, really nice. The front I really like, the front bonnet and the whole of the uh, face uh, looks aggressive and nice, I like that. I still think the uh, rear of the car is, is plain and generally it is a fairly anonymous looking vehicle. Um, interior, it's kind of fashionable now, I think it looks a little like a Transformers interior, a little underwhelming, but well made, functional, um, I think it will date. Um, but clearly this car is all about the drive, the experience of driving, um, the four wheel drive, the technology, a driver's car, understated driver's car, very different to the um, Mark II. So I think the true test is the, in the drive. And I don't think 
we can review it properly until such time as I've driven it. So looks, yeah, not the greatest, um, but it's drawing a lot of attention and uh, it should go like the clappers. Anyway, um, hope you enjoyed this video and uh, hope to talk to you again soon. Bye-bye.